Dave's Christmas Cracker. The story is about. Christmas is big and quite fantastic, just like Dave. Dave loved Christmas because everything was bigger and better. Tickles were bigger, naps were bigger, and the dinners were quite frankly enormous. It was Christmas Eve and everyone in the garden had hang up their stockings. So had Dave. Everyone in the garden had made a special snack for Father Christmas. And so had Dave. Everything was ready. The next time I wake up, thought Dave, it will be Christmas morning. Later that night, when all were asleep, along came Father Christmas. He slid down the chimney, he filled up the stockings, he put presents under the tree, ate the snacks. Oh, Dave, you shouldn't have. And feeling a bit full, went back up the chimney. Dave, wake up, shouted Bob. It's an emergency. Oh, oh, Father Christmas was stuck up the chimney. <gasps> oh, dear. The animals got together to help set Father Christmas free. Dog thought he'd scare him free. Rabbit thought he'd tickle him fully. And Mouse had a pointy stick. No, 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 shouted Bug. There's only one way to set him free. Everyone grab a present and meet me outside. The animals worked together and built a present tower that reached all the way up to the roof. Up you go, Dave, said Bug. And whatever you do, don't look down. Up Dave climbed higher and higher and higher until he reached the top. Finally, Dave was in position. It was time to send in the sprouts. Everyone load their buckets and aim for Dave's head, shouted Bob. Dog dangled sprouts into Dave's mouth. Rabbit threw them in and Mouse catapulted them in. Dave shook, the chimney shook, the house shook. Everyone pretty much knew what was about to happen. Five, four, Three, two, one. <gasps> Blast off! What happened? Yes, he's free. Father Christmas is free from the chimney. Thanks, shouted Father Christmas as he set off to deliver the rest of his presents. Just one mince pie for you next year. Hang on a minute, I think I'm stuck. And that's poor Dave, look. Now he's stuck in the chimney. Oh dear. 